Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Avanti Morocha. Today I'll show you how to engrave cork using Glowforge. I'll be using three different settings and getting three different results. You choose which one you like. If you are not familiar with Glowforge, check my video about it. If you are interested in a Glowforge, you can use my referral link which can save you up to $500 when purchasing a machine and it helps me to create more content. Now let's begin. For this project, I'll be using this cord three beds from IKEA. I'll also use these designs that are part of my subscription to create a fabrica. If you are using images from a subscription or bought online, I recommend simplify the anchor points. For this, go to objects, path, simplify. I have already simplified the number of anchor points in these designs. I also added a round frame with some small circles as decorations. I'll save each design individually as SVG files and use different settings in each of them. Remember, engraving always takes a lot of time, even when using a laser machine. The larger the design and the more detail you want, the longer it will take. I'll upload the file to the Glowforge software, center the design, go to the header bar and select set focus, click on the center, I'll select the layer with the circle and click on ignore. Click on the other layer, select engrave and I'll be using the following settings. A speed 1000, power 20, 190 fine lines per inch, and one pass. The time to complete the engraving is 28 minutes 50 seconds. As mentioned before, the more detail is in the engraving, more time it will take, which is the same as having more lines per inch. Here is the result, it looks great and there is a lot of detail, however it took a long time. For the following design I'll be using the same speed of 1000, I'll reduce the power to 15 and the number of lines per inch to 125 with one pass. The time to complete the engraving is 18 minutes 23 seconds. In this design, the time was reduced because I'm using less power and reduced the lines per inch. Here is the result. The engraving still looks pretty good. For this design, I'll keep the speed of 1000, the power of 15, but I'll reduce the lines per inch to 75 and use one pass. The time to complete the engraving is 11 minutes 16 seconds. The engraving time is notoriously less in this design because I reduced the number of lines per inch to 70. If you are familiar with graphic design, this is similar to dots per inch when printing. Even though the engraving is lighter, it's still good. This is my favorite setting because it doesn't take so long. Here are the three three beds next to each other so you can choose the settings you like the most. The best way to make personalized three beds and then being still functional is by engraving. I hope you like this video and you find it informative. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section. If you are interested in a Glowforge, you can use my referral link which can save you up to $500 when purchasing a machine. If you are new to my channel and you like what you see, hit the subscription button, tap the notification bell so you get informed every time I release a new video. Don't forget to visit my blog, follow me on my social media, like this video and share it with your loved ones. See you soon. Ciao, ciao.